Well, here we are, folks, at the end of everything. Human civilization as we know it is coming crashing down. The world is over, Donald Trump will be sworn in this, and then it's all over. I'm so scared. Insanity runs in my family, practically gallops. I'm so alone and so scared. We elected for the first time someone who is selfish, dishonest, egotistical, when we could have had Hillary Clinton instead. Now we're going to pay the price. Danger, Will Robinson, danger. We can survive this, okay? We can survive it, but you have to get underground. And I am uh, at my mom's house where I've been temporarily rooming for the last... Dave's not here! 31 years. Why don't you get a job for Chloe? And uh, I've, I'm down in the basement, as you can see. I've made kind of a bunker for myself here in the basement. You've got to get underground now because we don't have a lot of time. Look, based on everything that I've read on Facebook, right after the inauguration, um, Donald Trump is going to drop a nuclear bomb on Mexico. And then uh, after that, the full-scale genocide of women and transgender people and gender non-conforming people will begin. Um, after that, according to my sources, Donald Trump at the behest of Putin will deliberately dump 100 billion gallons of oil into the ocean in order to kill all of the dolphins. And then, um, based on what I've heard from people like Keith Olbermann, he is going to blow up Jupiter with a death ray. Uh, and finally, in his last act of cruelty and sadism, the last straw for all mankind will be when he blocks CNN reporters on Twitter. This is all going to unfold very quickly, so um, uh, you need to prepare yourself now. And if you have not been stocking supplies and foods, you got to do that. Um, I have all of the supplies I'm going to need to survive the apocalypse right here, and I wanted to show you a few of the things that I have just to give you, um, just, just just to give you some ideas of what you need to, to have to be prepared. You're obviously going to need a lot of non-perishable food items, uh, such as yogurt, uh, vegan, plant-based, of course. A classic approach to the problem, if I do say so myself. Other survival foods, uh, pita chips, gluten-free, obviously. If you ever run out of anything, plenty of Starbucks cards to restock during the apocalypse. Now, of course, that's just obvious. Um, what are you people, on dope? I should warn you that the apocalypse can be a very stressful time, and that's why mindfulness coloring books, um, anti-stress art therapy, will will really do a lot to calm your nerves as the apocalypse progresses. Now, um, uh, well, and, and obviously, you don't want to forget about hygiene even during the apocalypse. So, a lot of lavender soap for exfoliation purposes. Uh, during Armageddon will be important. Now here's the other thing. The apocalypse can be a really dicey time and people might come to your house wanting to loot and wanting to murder and so forth as the apocalypse is happening. And that's where Redneck Hicks will say, well, you gotta get yourself a gun, you know, like the, the, the Third Amendment or whatever. Um, well, little do they understand because they're illiterate that according to statistics, 112% of people who try to use a gun in self-defense end up shooting themselves in the face with it. So instead, I have sternly worded form letters that I have written ahead of time that I will distribute to potential looters and murderers saying, don't loot me, don't murder me. Okay, this is all the stuff that you're gonna need. Get it together now, okay? We, we can survive it, but there are gonna be some tough times ahead and we're going to be needed when it's time to rebuild because after the apocalypse the world is going to need women's studies majors the world is going to need people who advocate for gender neutrality the world is going to need feminists to warn us when problematic things are happening okay they're going to need us things looked bleak for joe but they were even worse for mankind as joe and rita lay dormant the years passed and mankind became stupider at a frightening rate so be safe, be strong, and good luck.